how are you? I hope your day has been going really well and everything is great. So today I want to share all the Victoria's Secret lip glosses I have used and pretty much my most used from my whole collection of Victoria's Secret lip glosses. I have so many. And these are the ones that stand out for me using over and over again. <clears throat> I'm also showing discontinued um, flavors, unfortunately, because the website uh, does take down the seasonal ones after some time. So, but hopefully you can get this one. This one is the Apricot Spritz, and yeah, <laughs> but anyway, um, I hope that's interesting to watch, and with all that said, I will start the video right now. Okay, so the first lip gloss I want to show is what I'm wearing on my lips right now. And it's the one called Cherry Balm. I really love um, how it does have such a beautiful tint on my lips. It's not too intimidating for a red color as you see in the tube it's really sheared out the scent is a bit funky because it's trying to be a cherry flavor but it's very artificial this next one is the wild berry drench Now this one I've used a few times and it's clear with a bit of subtled shimmer and this one if I could describe it it's like a berry like a blueberry scent. This next one is Sun Kiss. Now this one you could see the the space right there, the usage. I actually really love this one and the flavor and scent is very unexpected. Yes, so this one smells like maple syrup. Like something you would use for pancakes, waffles. It smells so good and yeah this one I haven't reached for this one for a while but I really love um, the uniqueness that it brings. So this one is an original formula and it's the shiny kiss flavored gloss in more mimosa. could see that gap there. Uh, I've used this quite a bit. I think the formula is comfortable considering that it is on the sticky side. This one smells like an alcoholic drink. Almost like if it has a citrus twist to it. Or maybe it's a lime. It smells so good and it tastes very good too. Um, I think this one uh, I had it on the other day and I did eat a meal so I pretty much wiped it away. 
but as soon as I was getting ready to do my bedtime routine, I could still feel the, the moisture it leaves behind in my lips. So this for sure does not dry out my lip area and I think I really um, love that as well in the lip gloss. This next one is my favorite, and ironically, I don't like watermelon. But this one is Juicy Melon. And I really love using this during the summer when it's really hot out. Um, it smells like a light watermelon scent, nothing too overpowering. This next one I recently got a few weeks ago on their semi-annual sale. It's the Apricot Spritz. And this one I've been using for a while. You can see the space right there. This one is very interesting because it's supposed to smell like apricot. But for me, I feel like it has an orange cream um, note in here. This one also has like light gold shimmers. This next one is Sweet Truffle. This one is pretty much my mouse use as well. You can see there's a gap right here and up there. This one smells like Tootsie Roll. Next is Sugared Citrus. This one also has shimmer in it, but very subtle. And this one has a citrus scent. I can't recall the note, but there's something in here that is mixed with a citrus um, flavor in here. And it smells, it almost smells sweet, but it's not at the same time. Next is Passion Fruit. could see the space right here. This one has like a dual chrome finish. It's got like a blue reflect shimmer, but again, very subtle. And this one is very hard to describe. I think this one has more like a fruity berry note like a sour candy twist. I don't know. It doesn't smell as sweet as it sounds. Now this last one is apple tart. Now this one does have an apple note. But then I could almost catch a spice note like if it had cinnamon so that is it for today's video i hope you really like this short um informational video of victoria's secret lip glosses you know how much i love them i consider myself a little bit um, obsessed because ever since I've discovered Victoria's Secret that they had these tubes, I've never went back into not purchasing every collection that has come out through the seasons. And it's been fun. I love seeing the different varieties that they come out with. I feel like they're very uh, unique to each of their own and they don't really repeat 
the the flavored um, scents because like sweet truffle I've never seen it come back again and there's passion fruit uh, sun kiss like all these were different collections from different seasons so anyway um i hope to continue using those because i really find a hard time to remember when i'm trying to finish all the other lip all the other lip products i have from now on, I think I would just stick to Victoria's Secret lip glosses and just not buy anything else when it comes to the lips. So may God bless always. Um, be safe. I love you. You take good care. And I hope you have a great day or night, whatever time you're watching. And I hope to see you in my next video. Bye.